The Montgomery School Board met tonight to discuss the employment contracts for the new interim superintendent and chief school financial officer. Those posts are being filled by Jamie Wilson and Pamela Watkins, respectively, following the departures of Dr. Melvin Brown and Arthur Watts. WSFA 12 News reporter Monet Stevens joins us live in the studio with the details. Monet? Well, Valerie, details of the terms of the agreements are limited, but we do know both Wilson and Watkins are under six-month contracts to maintain stability during during the search for the next permanent superintendent and chief school financial officer. Board President Dr. Brenda DeRamus Coleman says the search will not be controlled by the school system, but by a search firm, which will create a profile of what the next superintendent should look like. The firm will consult members of the public using focus groups, town halls, and surveys to help them narrow down the list of applicants. They have resources that we don't necessarily have locally. They will be able to do a broader search and a more comprehensive search, uh, hopefully get us a broader range of wonderful candidates uh, to, to bring in for us to look at. Dr. Coleman added there have been some potential candidates that have already expressed interest in the position. Now, the board plans to send out requests for proposals to select a consulting firm, and that's when the search will officially begin, Val. All right, thanks a lot, Monet. The Montgomery Area Chamber of Commerce plans to hold a state of schools address during their board meeting on Thursday. Interim Superintendent Jamie Wilson and other district administrators from the district will discuss the current state of MPS and their plans to move forward.